go to this uh, men's discus competition. It's been uh, going for a little while now. So che, the uh, Olympic medalist from Tokyo. Slovenian. Just outside the medals in Tokyo, of course, Stoll taking the gold ahead of Pedersen, his teammate and vice I think it was, who took the bronze, excuse me, vice I think at the moment, in sixth place as we uh, go to this competition. Che there, 65-17, a really solid opener. Stoll last in the throwing order of the eight men out there. Only one loss this year, and that to Pettersen, his compatriot. And that is big. That is huge from Stuhl. The meeting record stands at 68-87. Well, that was his own meeting record from last year. Indeed, uh, one day short of a year ago. But that from Stuhl is big. Only he and Che have thrown over 70 meters this year and 67-79. Brilliant opener from the Olympic champion. Now Pettersson opening with 61-20. It's his second round effort. And that's not bad at all, just below 65 meters. Psychologically, Stuhl's opener was so big, it's almost a slap in the face for the others. It really is, it can have a, such a huge effect in the uh, field disciplines if you can open in the throws and jumps with a monstrous effort. And Stuhl's was pretty solid. He has thrown uh, 71.40 this year. He's the world number one, just ahead of Che. I said that only he and Che have thrown over 17 meters. But that from Pedersen. Competition. We've had five men clear 5.72 already. I know, yeah, and of course we had a, a real fantastic competition in Zurich last week. I think uh, six men went over 5.83, which had only been achieved once before. But uh, we'll come back to this discus competition where the lead still held by Stuhl with that uh, opener of 67.79. And second place with Christian Che, his opener. 65-17. He fouled out in the second and third rounds, did Che. But uh, Pettersson was 64-77. A little frustrated with the third and fourth round fouls. Here is Christian Che. Round four unfolding. He's in second place. No, I don't think he catches that one. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Below 60 meters, I think, and he falls out on purpose. And I'm just clung into his hand to get the moment of release at all, right? Flight. And he knew it was a, an awful effort. By many athlete standards, very solid indeed. Probably about 59 meters. But he's thrown. Uh, a great deal further than that as Christian Che is the world number two with 70.35. That was back in late June. Jenny, this fellow Stahl, he's a mountain of a man. I love it when he celebrates after big victories. World number one and uh, Olympic champion. And a very relaxed effort there from him. About 62, 63 metres. Reigning world and Olympic champion. To settle for second in 2018 behind Lithuania's Andreas Gudjus at the Europeans in Berlin. But now he's uh, in the groove and at the age of 29 and Stuhl has uh, nobody who really threatens him. He's actually the fifth longest thrower in history. So he compares well with any era. Well, I still remember those uh, celebrations in Doha at the World Championships when he <laughs> won. And uh, I think everyone took him to heart there. He uh, was wrestling the mascot and uh, he sprinted into the middle of the infield. And uh, yeah, it was just such a great character and personality of our sport. I'll be back.